What the heck? All right. Broadcast is live. Blast off. Hello, everyone. Welcome <laughs> back to Building with Bunny with Grandma Badger Bricks. We are here. We are tired, but we are here. Why are you so tired? Because I've had a very busy couple of days. Oh. I'm feeling slightly under the weather from it all. Well, my goodness. Then I would really like to just curl up into bed with a pug. But instead, well, I'm going to build Lego with my, with my mom. Well, you could have curled up. Oh, geez. Come on, little man. You were sitting up before. What? There's no curling up in Lego. <laughs> there you are. Now you sit there nicely. Little man fell off my shelf. You are having problems. Oh, I know. So we have Cliff in the chat. Hello, Cliff. Hi, Cliff. Thank you for being patient enough to wait for us as we got <laughs> our technical difficulties ironed out. Oh. God. And just a quick recap of what we're building. I am working on the Hocus Pocus house and that I'm can't fit on my table because the box is too big. And I'm doing the Fly House Ballroom. That name is so stupid. I went into Timu and they don't call it that at all. Why it came this way in my box and all the other ones were the Balloon House. Well, maybe it's a typo. Maybe it was supposed to say fly house balloon or something. I don't know. But anyways, it's a balloon house. And it's big pieces for adults. Oh, well, that's Little ones. No <laughs> mini build this time, then, what you're saying. That is correct. I got big pieces to work with. <laughs> All right. Well, we're off to the races. Here we go. Yes. All righty. Um, Cliff says, hope everyone is having a good Sunday. Well, so far, so good. I mean, I can't complain. Yes. I mean, I could always complain because I'm a woman and I always have something I could complain about. But <laughs> but I'll just go with no complaints, really. Yeah. No. I think my camera turned around so that it, it does this now. It's right over the top of me. And I can show something like this now. Oh, well, that's nice. I was trying to get the camera off the tripod in case I want to like show you the inside of this house. Yeah. But nor Bluegrass or myself could figure out how to get the camera off. Well. See. And then I ran out of time. Well, that's all right. If I put more time into this project, <laughs> just showing 10 minutes before we're going live. Well, I'm yeah, careful. the whole idea. Well, I'm doing diamond arts over on my other table. And uh, I just sit here and I got everything set up and I was just waiting for, yeah. for Lego time. Zizu! Hi, Zizu! Hello, Zizu. He says, hi, <laughs> Grandma Badger, Bunny, and everyone. Ah, how sweet. So happy y'all could join us today. Yes, that is very, very nice. So this is Nashville hype. We are hype in Nashville. Everybody we know is going to Nashville. And I know. We I are know. going to Nashville as well. When is that? Labor Day weekend. Labor Day weekend. Okay. And I heard that Butt Chop is going to be able to go. He is going to go. And we have the pleasure of driving him back this away um, so he can pick up his vehicle at Hoosiers. Oh, how we're staying an extra day. We were going to come back just Saturday to Sunday, but we're going to stay till Monday since it's the holiday. Uh huh. And then Butt Chop will hook a ride back with Chuck and I. Um, and he can hang out with us for a while, and then we'll take him over to Hoosiers to pick up his car. Oh, nice! I'm glad he could yeah. make it. That's positively wonderful. Yeah, he had a a. a change in luck and he was able to work some things out and um you know we're all just working with him to get him to where he needs to be well sure absolutely well that's terrific um cliff says whoop whoop that was gonna be awesome <laughs> i agree now zizu are you coming because you have you're close you could come right I mean, I, I don't know what I'm going to do if I actually get to see Zizu in person. 
<laughs> I've never seen Zizu. Well, is it is it it is it a man? Is it a myth? What is it? I don't know. He I just might surprise you. I don't know. I'm very excited though. If he even comes. Yeah, that would be great if he could though. I think we will all want to hang out with him. Yeah. And I'm talking like he's not even here. What did he say? Oh, we have Brett in the chat. What a little slice of heaven this is, he said. <laughs> Hi, Brett. How are you? See, now it's all worth the technical difficulties it took for us to get here. I know. It just takes us a minute sometimes. Well, I send the link. The link doesn't work. Grandma's iPad doesn't work. You know. Whatever. It's we all okay. Rolling now. We got it rolling. It's all good. And I'm building something with big pieces so that my fingertips can rest. All those little mini guys. Holy mackinoli. Zizu said Nashville's pretty far from me. I'm on the opposite opposite I'm on opposite of Kentucky, hoping to make it for one day though. Oh my god, that would be amazing. Yeah, that would be nice. I was expecting Red Bull in my cup and it's water. <laughs> <laughs> that was sad. Aw. Uh. Yeah. I have coffee and water and red grapes. I know. I was going to do coffee. I was going to make another cup because I was feeling a little bit lack. And then I was like, I don't know. Then am I going to not want to be lack when I get done because I'll be all wired? Uh, coffee doesn't. Well, you drink it like espresso, but uh, regular coffee, I just have a cup of coffee and it's one o'clock. I don't have any problems falling asleep. Tunk, I go down. Yeah. <laughs> I spent three hours on the patio this morning working on the book. Uh huh. And I have I, what I wanted. So I was just going to do images, right? Because it's just for me. But then I was like, well, I'm going to want to remember all the nice people that took all these images, right? Yeah. So then I had to go and find all of the people on Instagram or through the orders of who took all the images. And then I put all their little captions next to the pictures. And I still want to like do like a, this isn't the right phrase, but like about the author kind of thing in the yeah. book so that I remember like what my Etsy shop said and like what my description was and when I described myself, that kind of thing. Yeah. So I need to do that yet. And then I think the book is ready to go. Okay. I hope. I hope there's nothing I've forgotten. So I did that for three hours. Fido hung out with me on the patio. Charles's caboose is dragging. He did the flea market yesterday, and boy, did he have a good day there. Well, good. I'm sure he may show up later and tell us all about it. Hey, if he's if he's making money, that's terrific. He made a lot of money yesterday. That's good. Um, ooh, we got hearts. We have smiley faces i can't see because it's so tiny <laughs> um are am i writing a book no cliff what i'm doing is i had an etsy shop where i created cocktail picks that hold olives and martinis or in different drinks um and throughout i had this shop for about five years so throughout time i had some really artistic people um mixologists uh bars restaurants buy the pics and then like do really great photography with these pics. And so they sent me all of these pictures and I want them all kind of documented somewhere. So on Shutterfly, you can create like your own 10 by 10 book. I'm kind of joking, calling it a coffee table book. It's not very big, it's 10 by 10, but I've taken all of the best images um, throughout the course of time. And a bunch of images I took as well for advertising and I'm just gonna compile them all in the book. So I have a really nice remembrance of it. Because I don't think I'm going to go back to my Etsy shop. I'm kind of, I, I closed it down right after Christmas last year and thought, well, I'm going to, I'm going to give it 30 days and see if this is something I still want to do. And after 30 days, I was like, I don't miss it. I'm going to go give it another 30. And now we're in August. So Etsy's great, but it's kind of costly and it's a lot of time to have an Etsy shop. 
when you physically create something that isn't digital. Um, and it's just a lot of time and a lot of pimping your wares, a lot. And it just doesn't leave time for Lego or travel or, you know, anything else. Well, and you just kind of change, you know, from year to year. Right. Um, there's a lot of things that um, I've noticed with myself with building Lego and my diamond art. And I have a couple of things around the building here that I still do with, with neighbors and friends. But like uh, this coming week, uh, there's a, a trip to Blue Lotus. And I, went, I went last year and I had a ball of fun. It, it's a senior community projects that everything is free. You, they take a school bus and pick up all the seniors, take them out to this place in West Bend. There's fishing, there's games, there's uh, kayaks, there's all sorts of different things. They feed you. There's a swimming pool. Now, it was great last year, but I'm not going to go this year because I don't feel like it. Really? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it was wonderful, but that's how things change with people. You just... Yeah. Uh, it's, I'm not poo-pooing it because it's wonderful. Right. You get to meet a lot of different people, but I just don't feel it in me this year to go. So I'm not going to go. And that's with Etsy. That's with anything. You know, yeah. you change year after year and you decide you don't want to do it anymore. You know? Yeah. So that is what I was referring to. Um Yes, Zizu, Bunny is going to Bunny Me. Yes, I'm going to Nashville. Um, did you know Cliffy's been hating on that new Dreams Blue Bunny? Brat. Cliff, stop hating on the bunny. <gasps> Don't make me. Don't make me come for you in Nashville. <laughs> um, Zizu, if so, Haley insists that Willie loves hugs. Yeah, I'm not sure that Willie loves hugs. I think you are being facetious when you say that. Um, now, that's the kind of book I would love to do research for. Yes. Sample the drinks and critique them. Yes, exactly. Right. Mm -hmm. I was just really super lucky. Like, and it's funny because I have this Marilyn Monroe picture right behind my monitor here. And there's the quote on it that says, I'm not interested in money. I just want to be wonderful. And that is literally the picture that spurred this business. And that phrase is what it was about. So for me, it wasn't about making a million dollars. It was about being wonderful. And I achieved so much with these wonderful, talented people. And so I kind of wanted to go out on the top like Seinfeld. Like, you know, last year was the, the biggest year I'd earned. And again, it wasn't a million bucks, but it was still a lot of money for a part-time little Etsy shop. Yep. Um, and I just had such great things and I just wanted to go out on that note versus, you know, now I can't get any business kind of thing. And I have learned about cocktails along the way and I have picked up a gin addiction along the way. Yeah. Addiction? I don't know. <laughs> And he does love a good dirty martini. And I've kind of like learned to like collect different um, spirits now. Like I've, I've had like two or three different type gins and they all differ in flavor and, and how they're made. And it's, it's, it's fascinating to me. So I'm still going to continue with that. That will always be something I enjoy because I'm kind of a foodie. So to work a cocktail in there is, is not a reach for me. If I can get, well, I can't, I don't think I can get the book done and shipped in two weeks, but I would have brought it to Nashville for people to look at if they wanted to. It's not Lego, but it's still something really fun. <laughs> yeah. That would probably mean I'd have to submit that order pretty soon, though. Well, there's always another time. Or you can show it on air here. You can see the book, whatever. That is true. Oh, that is true. Ah, here you are, you little rascal. Come over here. And we have, to, oh, God, is it nice building with real big parts. 
Man. You mean normal size parts? Normal size. You're not parts. building with Duplo, are you? <laughs> no, but I wouldn't mind that once in a while. I'll tell you, these old hands get a little tired. <laughs> Well, what the heck am I doing here? Maybe it's a gray one. Aha, it is a gray one. All right, there we are. Now, let's... I'm giving you a hard time, Grandma. Nope. Nope. I've got it all sorted out very nicely, and it's working. But I would like to show you my diamond art that I'm doing. Just me, or can we show the group? Oh, no. Everybody can see it. <laughs> That's not a problem. All right, putting you on the big screen. I've only got half of it done. Ooh, pretty. But, but it is, it is a, it, it's a jewel. It is a jewel. Yeah, and it's a big flower, multicolor, and then the background is black, and it kind of twinkles if you can see it on the screen. Yeah. Yeah. You are knocking these out. I have not had the time to sit down and work on mine. Well. You know, I uh, I enjoy doing it, and that's why I just do it. I'm not knocking them out. It's I took my time. I still got. I mean, I sorted out all of my um, diamond arts, and woo, I got lots. My book is this fat. <laughs> yeah, right. I know with the drills, but uh, that's the little pieces. But. Um, I took time and I got it all taken care of, but I also set up a bag and a tote bag and stuff that I might take all of this in my tray. I use a, a muffin tray to hold my little jars of uh, drills Yeah, and it works out real nice that I could maybe go down outside on the picnic table and oh, sure. do it, you know? And I've got it all so that I can just slip it into a bag, a tote bag, and it's portable. Everything's portable. And if I'm doing it outside, I don't need my light. You know, I can do without. Well, and it just would... good weather coming. Yeah, yeah. Where you're not so we, hot outside. Right. And we have tables out there with umbrellas and stuff. So if you don't want the sun and everything. So I thought, well, let's get that all together. And that's what I did today. Along with this morning, I ran to walk, walked. Then I ran to Walmart. Then I came home and I made shrimp salad. And then I made individual chicken pot pies and they turned out fantastically. Of course they did. I've tried it before with biscuits and it didn't work. And somehow something instilled in me how to do it. And I did it and it worked. So that's all for this week. I can have a little individual pot pie. Yum. Yum. Well, I'm enough for chicken pot pies. I'll tell yeah. you. Susie can tell you that. A nut. <laughs> I wasn't surprised when she sent me the picture this morning. Well. <laughs> but when something turns out so nice, it, it just tickles my funny bone, I'll tell you. Yeah. And it tastes so good. I, cause I make my own white sauce and everything and it just, I put the veggies in and the chicken and onions and seasoning and it just worked out beautiful. I wish my body didn't act like it was 90. <clears throat> well, but we, had, we, we had a fun weekend. Paige came and stayed the night Friday. Um, I got off of work early on Friday, took her to see the Barbie movie. Did she like it? She did. Well, look, that's... And we spent that's time great. talking. She's all grown up and, like, so fantastic right now. Yeah, well, that's... I don't know that it will last, but it's wonderful while it's here. <laughs> you know how teenagers can be. Yeah. Um... But that was great. And then what did we do Friday night? Oh, um, I had picked up the Target Monopoly game at Ben's. Uh -huh. 
So she helped me decipher it, which was fun. So we played that until almost midnight. I think it was about that late. And then um, yesterday, Stacy, her, and I went to the outlet mall that's in Edinburgh, like up north. Yeah, I saw that. Where? Where's that? We've ne I've never been there, right? I do not think you've been there, no. No, because it didn't ring a bell to me. Um, but we had lunch. Where did these pieces go? Hold on. I got a leaf and a leaf and one, two, three, one, two. Okay. Where do these pieces go? Oh, next page. Okay, fine. Um, yeah, so we had a ball. And actually, I think I was broken as of yesterday because I didn't buy anything i went to the coach store wandered around in the coach store for like 30 minutes didn't buy a thing stacy well said, i wonder are why are you okay <laughs> but i'll tell you even though it's an outlet store the prices with inflation are ridiculous yeah and like i don't have a problem spending money if it's something i really want i don't have a problem spending money um but I just could not justify the craziness yeah. of those prices. We went into several stores and I'm like, I, uh, Paige needed a pair of jeans for, well, she didn't need, I kind of forced them on her, but um, for school. And I said, just go pick out a pair. And she picked out a pair that was on clearance. So like the main price was 109 and then it was 30% oh off. So even that was 65 bucks for a pair of jeans. You got to be kidding. I am not kidding. Oh, my God. And it's at the outlet mall. So, I don't know. Maybe I've just turned old and disgruntled, but I guess I don't need a coach bag anymore. And I really don't. I don't really need anything at all, ever. But Well, and I'll tell you something else. Timu has changed our eyes a lot, too. Yeah. And I know that it's not coach, and it's not... The coach is made in China. So, really? Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> I should be looking for coach knockoffs on Timu. <laughs> yeah, there you go. But I mean, that that opens one's eyes so much that even all of these stores, I don't care what store you go into, you look at the tag, made in China. Well, if they're made in China, Timus are the regular real price. And these stores are inflating this because they have astronomical rents to pay with their big buildings and everything else. But I mean, why should we pay for that? I just, I'm sorry. Yeah, I've got, you know, I just can't see it. Now, I'm not going to lie. We did go into Bath and Body Works and I did get sucked into the buy three, get three free. So I did. Yeah. You've always bought that. That's I know. And I always different. get sucked in. And it's always okay. like, I always get sucked into the lip gloss. I always do. Because yeah. they have like great lip gloss. Well, all right. Get but, into that. Yeah. And you do it. And so what? You know, like you say, you but, will buy certain things. But, you know, you're getting somewhat of a bargain that with that. Right. Well, compared to... It actually probably brings even sixty five dollars for a pair of jeans. Right. I mean, good lord. I know. Well, uh, it's very yeah. nice of you to do that for her. Well, you know, I'm a stepmom after all. Yeah. So, you know, it was good. It was just busy. It's an hour and a half ride there and back, and so it's three hours in the car. Um, but we had a good time and we had lunch at Ruby Tuesday, and I think it's like one of the last places with a salad bar. So I was thrilled to death to have a salad bar. Yeah, I saw the pictures. And um, what did I do last night? I think I just hung around the house last night. I was in Hoosier Stream for a minute or two in the chat. Yeah, I was too. I was didn't stay long, but I heard. Why did you say hello? Did you say hello? No, because I, there was no play. The chat wasn't up yet, so I couldn't do it. But they were talking, so I was just listening. And that's when Haley said, 
that Chop was going to be in Nashville. And I thought, well, hallelujah, that's terrific. Maybe you need to hit the live chat button in order to see the chat. There was no live chat button, honey. Oh. I, I'm i quite familiar with that. Oh. When I go into one, there oh. was no, maybe because nobody else used it yet. I don't know. Yeah, maybe. I know I'm not real techie, but that, that part I know. I search around and I can find, but I don't know, whatever. But I was just so happy to hear about Chop being able to go. As was I. Yeah. So as of right now, he's going. Woohoo! Good, good, good. Nope, that's not it either. Um I don't have any little gray ones. Well, Stacy really enjoyed spending time with Paige because she hadn't seen her in a while. Yeah, that's good too. It was a win win. It was. So, you know, and I think I talked about this last time. My BFF is a great person, but she is not a planner when it comes to things. So usually I'm the one who plans the, hey, what are you doing this weekend? Yeah. And then she is the one that shows up and has a great time. And last, not last week, but the week before, I made her do it. And she was at a complete loss. <laughs> so I said, I'm taking back the power. So <laughs> whatever we did last week was fun. And then I said, I texted her for this week and I said, do you want to stay local or go off the grid? And she said, go off the grid. <laughs> and I said, yes. And so then I told her the plan and she's like, oh my God, you just now raised the bar. How am I ever going to keep up with this? <laughs> I don't like driving yesterday. I'm not ready to drive up north yet. Go where? Up by you. I'm not ready for that long trek yet. Oh, well, you would did that once already this year. Well, good thing these are regular size things because I didn't have two little gray caps, like they're telling me. Uh oh. And I can use regular Lego caps in my stock. Yeah. Hallelujah. Oh. All right, now we're going to put this into here. How can Cliffy be hating on the cute little blue rabbit? What blue rabbit? In the dreams. In the dream sets, they have a cute little blue rabbit. Oh. Why is Cliffy hating on the blue rabbit? Well, maybe he doesn't like bunnies. Well, well you know. That would be ridiculous, wouldn't it? I don't know. Not like rabbits? Well. Come on, Cliffy, defend yourself. There's some people that might not like bunnies. Now, that's yeah. not... That's not what? That's not us. <laughs> because I got my cute little bunny with a little baby bunny sitting in my little shadow box. Very nice. See? And I got four little white bunnies. God had to gather them all together. The little stinkers. They were hopping all over the place. The craziness that's ensuing at your house. Yep. Well, I'm glad you all had a nice weekend. 
that's terrific. Yeah, Charlie did well at the flea, and and that's fantastic too. Yep, got a little more sunburn. Yeah, yeah. Got early this time though. Yeah, but you know, that's really great. And he's getting rid of things that are valuable to somebody else. It's like a, another man's treasure. Well, that's what he said last night when he was sitting and talking to me on the patio. He was like, "Woo, just the release of getting rid of all that stuff. Well, sure. Yeah. I mean, you don't want to throw away anything good. Oh, and by the way, I want you to forget about the size of the tool that I needed for my walker. Why? Because I went to Menards and I found myself a very nice sales clerk. He was so great. Because I had a couple of questions for him because I could kept seeing three-eighths drive, half-inch drive. And I didn't know what that meant to get a socket and a ratchet. And I said, I've got this question for you. So I said it to him. But I said, let me think and let me give you my idea. I said, is it the top of the socket that is three-eighths? So you have to get a three-eighths ratchet. Or a half inch? He said, absolutely right. And he said, so what are you doing with it? And I said, well, my walker, the wheels wobble when it's too loose. So I want the socket and the ratchet to tighten it up and be a little more independent. I said, my neighbor fixed it for me first off, and I appreciate it so much I made him peanut butter cookies. <laughs> and he started laughing. He said, boy, I wish I was your neighbor. <laughs> and so I said... Um, but you know, these are all expensive and he says, exactly. Let's, I'll take you over here. You get a three eighths drive. That's $5. And he said, and you don't need these big heavy duty ratchets. That's for under a car hood where you really have to do a lot of pulling and torquing and all that stuff. He said, you're sitting right there. You can just go. So he gave, showed me a little short one. And the whole thing came to 20 bucks and I said, it's sold. Hmm. So I've got everything I need. I've got it in with my walker. And when it gets loose again, I'll just tighten it up. And it's very easy for me to do. It, it doesn't use need strength from my hand. So that's terrific. Right. And Charlie doesn't have to go looking for used parts for me. All right. Well, I and I know he would have done that. I should have well, said something when he I did, was done. He found some on Amazon. But then I said to him, you were already pricing things at Menards. Yeah. Yeah. So I said, that's fine. And I, I thought about it and I thought, well, I can just wait. And if it loosens up, I can ask Dennis here again. And I thought, no, just go get your tool. And then you've got it done. You don't have to bother anybody. And that's what I did. And I happened to find... Better prices than what I was looking at. So it worked out just perfect. Well, good. Yeah. So you can you can um, delete the sizes in your, <laughs> delete that message that I sent you. All right. But I should have said something when I was down there because they were getting a little loose. But I thought I didn't want to bother Charlie either, you know. None of us want to bother Charlie. Well, you know. And I'm sure he would have taken care of it, one, two, three, but it just worked out this way and it was fine. Because you know me, I'm kind of independent and I like to have my tools to do what I'm supposed to do with them. Yeah, I know. Independently. I mean, I don't mind baking cookies for people, but if I can learn how to do something myself, I'd like to do it that way, as long as I can do it. Right now, I think, well, I'm not sure. I may have to do it myself, but he's building a new office chair for me currently. Oh, Ooh. you bought a new one? I did. It's actually oh. a gaming chair. A what kind of chair? Um a gaming chair that people who play video games sit in. Oh, okay. Um, and it had a high weight ratio. <laughs> but it also 
looked very comfortable and it has a footrest and okay but see you're sitting in that chair for eight hours a day and that's a very good idea yeah. sometimes it's more it's comfortable yet yeah, because it ain't built yet so well <laughs> yeah. your fingers yeah no charlie will get it together well, the parts are there. He'll get it together. He knows how to do that kind of stuff. I ain't there so if There's 10 screws left over after the edit. <laughs> no, well. He was going to do it, but then I hollered at him. So <laughs> I'm not sure he's going to do it for me. Well. I may have to do it for myself. Shame on you. You want him to do something, you can't be hollering at him. Well, he shouldn't be a boob. <laughs> That's scary to tell you. Uh, wait a minute here. We gotta put this here. Yeah. And then we gotta put this. Wait a minute. Oh, okay, this way. All right. Yeah. Now. And maybe I'm not in the greatest mood. So there. Did you hear that, Bluegrass? Um, Dude Jude's in the chat. He says, hello, Grandma Badge Bricks and Bunny and Zizi and Brett and Cliff. Hi, Dude Jude. <laughs> My mind went blank. I'm sorry. <laughs> I gave you too many names there. You weren't sure who you were responding to. No. <laughs> Plus, I'm trying to figure out where the heck this thing goes, and it doesn't connect to anything. Wait a minute. Wait a minute here. Uh, there's nothing to connect. You don't just set it there. Oh, what the hey? Oh, wait a minute. That goes there. She always figures it out, people. She always figures it out. That goes there. Oh, it's a little gate. Oh, my God. How cute is that? <laughs> I wasn't watching where the arrows were going. <gasps> Look at this. It's a little gate. Three. Ooh. See? And the gate opens. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> How cute is that? Oh, my God. Okie dokie. There we go. Oh, good. Now I get to put up fencing all the way around. Woohoo! He's excited about fencing. Hey, when it's this size, you betcha, because my hands are very excited about it. Yeah. Um... How are we doing this? Oh, I have a pumpkin. Pumpkins are so cute. Look at that for your reason. Yeah. I don't think that there's a right right side or a wrong side on this fence. Doesn't look like it. Nope. Not like in real life. I don't want to talk about fences ever again. Oh. Well, yours is just fine now. It is, but it took a long time for it to get fine. Well, I know. Sometimes it does. Sometimes it does. I don't want to talk about that or a roof ever again. That or what? A roof ever oh. again. Oh, a roof. Yeah. When I, when I get to the point of needing one again, I'm just going to move. Those are little horns. That's a cute little detail. A 
look at the handles. Oh, shoot. Come back here. On this little stairway coming down. They're horns. Oh, look at how cute. And a little pumpkin. Very cute. Um, mm, 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 mm. Let's see if we got any more gray in here. Did you win at games this week? Uh, no, I did not. But it's okay. Is it though? <laughs> not really, you know, but, you know, what can you do? You got to just suck it up and forget about it. It isn't fun when other people keep winning and you don't. And I figure I've got just as much luck and skill as the next one. Yeah. But, you know, such is life. It's all right. I'll get them one of these days. Well, I did. Wasn't it Tuesday? Yeah, because Gloria wasn't there. I did win at Konami. Oh. Because Gloria wasn't there. And I told her that. And she said, oh, come on. I said, don't give me that. You win all the time. Hardly ever does Marlene win or Anna. Anna wins once in a while. But I said, I introduced the game to you. And I'll be darned. I don't win. <laughs> Funny. But it's okay. We have fun. We laugh. We joke. It's quite all right. Oh, this was the front porch. Get home in there, little peg. Well, one peg went in. Of course, the pumpkin pops off. Just coming right along. I know, so is mine, but I'm still wondering about this. Now they're asking me for another gray one, and I don't have any gray ones. Well, I'll just go in my stock and such is life. If I need them, I need them. Otherwise, they'll go back in stock. There. That should carry me through. Overstock, I mean. Bulk. Bulk. There we go. Yes, bulk. Even Grandma's got bulk. Oh, God, yes. I've got four trays of these big five-ounce condiment things full of bulk. So, I got bulk. <laughs> I'm so afraid this wheel is going to fall off. And I'm not, ugh, just don't even look at it. Moving right. on. Bag 13. Lucky number 13. Uh-oh. Oh, no, 14. I'm on 14. Only two more bags. 14 and 15. Wow, good job. This little shadow box, I found it at Goodwill, and what it is, it's a wire mesh type of thing for offices, but it had four compartments and wide open two shelves. I thought, you know, if I put dividers in there, I've got a total of eight little animals that can fit in there, and this one had 12, so I could add two more of mine. And that's why I bought it, and it was a couple of bucks, and I thought, I can hang that on the wall and put all of my little guys in there, because they look so tiny compared to a regular brick head. <laughs> that's because they are. Mm -hmm. But they're just so darn cute. You have to keep the elementary 
um, school kids away from the middle schoolers and the high schoolers. That's right. That's right. Ooh, look at this fancy headpiece. One the moment. And the hat all in one. Ooh, that's neat. It is neat, and it's curly. Ooh, look at her. Oh, look at her. She's a pretty witch. Love it. Charlie and I organized our Halloween bins today. Well, that's good. We have a lot of Halloween prep. To decorate and costumes. Yeah, because yep. he... Hmm. He always dresses up. He does like to, yes. Yeah. And then one costume for me is actually the Sanderson sister from this set. Oh, yeah. The main character. I found the dress and I made a book. The book yeah. is outstanding. I can't part with the book. No. It's probably one of my greatest art projects ever is making you that should, spell book. You should put that book wherever you put that house yeah and make a setting i had this um it was more of um so it looked like a book, but when you open the cover, it was like storage inside. So uh -huh. it, was big, it was a big book, like 12 by 8 or something, 12 by 10 maybe. And so that's what I turned into the spell book. Yeah. I covered it all with clay to make it brown leather looking like. And I made the eyeball and I made the hand that closes it all out of clay. And then I painted it so that it looked old and antique -y. It really turned out well. Well, that's what I mean. You should, you got to put the two together, especially because you got the house now and you got the book and, you know, it would just, that's what I'm trying to do with my Legos is kind of group the stuff together. Even if you have non-Lego stuff, it just, it ties it all together and it makes it look nice. Yeah. What is everybody doing in the chat today? Yeah, we've been yakking up a storm. Hope everybody is enjoying their weekend. Hopefully not everybody had to work all weekend. Come on, little fence, get in there. There you go, there you go, there you go. All right. Ha ha. Well, doesn't this look cute? Yep. Well, I got the base done. We the fence all around. I like the bright green tile. I know. And then it's got these these things that you put up there like like to hold the balloons. Yeah. <laughs> or no, it holds the balloons in the house all together and it looks like it's floating up from the base. How cool is that? Wait to see it done. I know. It's going to take me a little while, probably next week too, because I just got this done now. All right, onward ever, backward never. Mm. 
<coughs> excuse me. Oh, that was part of the stuff I just did. Good Lord. Yeah. Oh, here it is. It's a clear one. There we go. All right. Now, what do we do? This in the bottom of this goes. Hello, bluegrass. Hi, bluegrass. What's with the soccer balls? Oh my. We put soccer balls in the chat. Does that mean you're a baller? <laughs> See this with the glare. Not the right size. I don't understand. All right, now. I don't understand. There. Oh, now I understand. Okay. Oh, World Cup, FIFA. Okay. Sorry, we weren't talking about that. I had no reference. You mean you're watching that and not this stream? Come on. Kidding. Well, he can do what he wants. Fine. Yeah. Right. I'll just wipe the tears away. Fine. Yeah. First it was Cliff not liking blue rabbits. Yeah. Brett didn't say nothing bad, though. I don't know if he's still here. I'm sure he's listening. Okay, that's good. And what the heck is this? Oh, he said, Charlie said he's watching both. Ah. Hmm. Is that a black piece? Hard to tell the colors sometimes. Where, oh where, oh where, oh where is it? Oh no, here it is. It's brown. All right. So, we are going. I don't think I showed you my new bunny slippers, did I? Your bunny slippers? Yeah. No. Let me see them. Oh, oh my God, how adorable. Aren't they cute? And they have a big rubber sill so I can go outside. Uh, is that a team? It is. Oh. I'm highly entertained by them. <laughs> Do those ears get in your way? Not at all. <laughs> and I influenced Stacy to buy a toilet light. <laughs> She's to good. buy what? A toilet light, and she said she loves it. <laughs> a toilet light? Yeah, it hooks onto your toilet, and it's a night light. So well, it's motion sensor. Put a night light in your bathroom so you can see the whole bathroom. I don't need to see the whole bathroom, and my outlet doesn't work in the bathroom. So oh. it's right. a little plastic doohickey that clips onto the toilet, 
and the light shines into the toilet and it changes color. So it's like rainbow and it, it changes all different colors and it's motion detector. So when you walk into a dark bathroom, it goes on. That's right. You're, yeah. That's why I always take my flashlight in. Yeah. I understand now. Greatest thing since popcorn. I know. Sometimes the street light gives you enough light <laughs> for your bathroom. Well, that's good. That's good. That's probably one of my most entertaining TV purchases. Well, yeah. It's a joy every time I walk in there after dark. <laughs> it lit up red when Charlie went in. He thought he was bleeding. <laughs> oh my gosh. Silly Charlie. Is Hoosier on right now? I don't think so. Charlie just said Brett and Zizu and Cliff on Hoosier stream, LOL. Really? He was on yesterday, on Saturday. When I is know. I don't know what it means. Now he's on Sundays too? I don't huh. know. Sometimes Charlie talks in code, so I'm not really sure what he's saying. Come on where you are. Where are you, you little rascal? Here you are. Okay. And these. An L shape. Where are you? There you are. And six knobs. Nope, oh, that's an eighter. There's a six. Six and then four, eight, four, eight, twelve. Okay, four, eight, twelve. Gotcha. Now put this one here, this one here, and then there. And this goes. Nope. That ain't gonna work. What the heck? Ugh. Yep, sure enough, he's on right now live. Hmm. Well, already then. Huh. Okay. Day building. Well, maybe this is the way.
Oh, this goes up here. There we go. Okay. Now this goes here then. But that doesn't connect that. Huh. It's all right, Bluey. And if you want to go over there and chat with them all, it's all good. They got a lot of building to do before the before the uh, Nashville show. Yeah. Because they are actually showing. So I'm sure they need every minute of every day to get that done. Well, what else do you know, little one? Um, I don't think a whole lot, unfortunately. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And I don't have much going on this week either. I think. I think we look ahead. Well, maybe it's worth it because you were pretty busy this weekend yeah but that's nice ah now did that work well hallelujah so you did it now onward ever backward never are you getting close to the end of your um, I'm, I'm finishing 14 here, and then I have one more. Wow. I don't know if I'll get it completed today, but I might try. Well, you got an hour left here. Yeah. So, we got to put this out here, I think. Yeah. And this goes here. Is the better Wait a minute. There. Okay, and then this goes here. I don't know what I'm building, but I'm putting it together. But boy, it's a lot to put together. Um, well, you'll be surprised when it all gets together. Yeah. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. These two. Ah. Hi, Kim Randall. How are you? Hi, Kim Randall. <laughs> Bluegrass says, I'm your emotional support, Blue Wolf. <laughs> Thank you, Blue. Nice to have you, Kim. How are you? Oh. This is difficult when you can't see exactly where they want you to put this. You just got a trial and error. And I think that's got to go there. I like yes. to see we're in acquired taste. <laughs> there. There's all slices of heaven on. I guess that's right. Onward, ever, backward, never. Oh, God, what a mess. The third time you've said that today. Are you stressed I, out? Well, I don't know what I'm building here. They don't show you. This must be part of the house or something, I would imagine. Yeah, must be. They don't say it's the house. And you got to build the house now, Sue. All right, well, then I'll build it. And then they will all come, right? Yes. If I build it, they'll come. <laughs> build it, Grandma. Build it. I'll build it. I'll build it. I'll build it. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> ah, jeez. One, two. Where's the other one? Come on here. Oh, there we are. There's the third one. 
and we make new ones. One. Said I'm good, thank you. How are you both? Thankful for a great stream to watch. Been quite a boring day. <laughs> We will provide as much entertainment as feasibly possible. <laughs> you right. never know what you're going to get. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> that was that's cute. Well, at least you can sit back and chuckle at us, right? And that's nice. That's fine. We don't mind that at all. That's why we are very different. <laughs> Exactly. We don't talk all legal. We talk everything. We do. Okay, so flip this around. Why would they have a bag? Yeah, they have a bag, but okay. It's not for me to question. It is only for me to build. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, but you know, sometimes you got to ask a question and say, hey, now wait a minute. What are we doing here? Is that supposed to be there? Oh, yeah. I actually wonder if I'm getting that cold back. Oh, no. That's not nice. And it could also account for my squirrely behavior, behavior earlier. Well. Louie, I'm sorry. I'm not feeling well today. Yeah, this was the fireplace. All right, then. Look at All right. All right. Now I got it. Now I got it. Mm -hmm. But now Bluey's going to say, I okay, need another sugar of coffee. Maybe it'll clear up my head. I need some coffee, I think. I've had mm. enough caffeine today, but I could really love a hot cup of coffee. Well, you know, the way I make my coffee with our syrup, you know, all the time, yep. it tastes pretty good cold. <laughs> right. Oh, I know. So, you know, if it, I drink it when it's, when it's hot, I mean, I don't like it hot, hot. I let it cool for a little bit. But if I leave the room, then I cover the top. And um, it's kind of nice when it does cool off. And Ooh, now, this is, is good. Piece. Look, they made a little hourglass oh my god how tiny and it's all one piece oh oh how can a machine do that i don't know and it's like perfectly carved out in the center Hold on. It's, it's perfectly like notched out there in the middle yeah because it's all i open. see that i yeah. see that i don't know i don't know how they do that kind of stuff I need to fly to Billund and take a tour or something. Where do I put this other piece? Oh, here. Ah. Ah. Under there. All right. All right. There we are. Gotcha. All right. Now. <laughs> do, 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 do. Ten past three. Time for tea. Tempest. Oh, yeah, yeah. Time for tea. Well, you should have a cup of tea. Have a make you a cup of tea. It might be good for you. Mm. Mm, I can hear the doubt in your mind. Oh, I can't because I like coffee. I think it seems very good on this one. I just slapped this crap together and didn't even, didn't even read the directions. <laughs> <laughs> just like, oh, this must go here. No, it doesn't. No, no. Stop thinking. Just follow the directions, Suzanne. <laughs> this goes up here. Yeah, okay. And where does that piece go? Oh, that goes there. Well, son of a gun, I'm getting there. Whatever I'm building here, it's starting to build up high. I don't know. I know I've got some windows here. I don't know if I have glass partitions, though. Nope, I don't think so. 
Why wouldn't they give me glass partitions to go into the windows? Maybe the windows just are open. I gotta look at the box. Hmm. Yeah, I guess so. Sometimes they do that. I the windows on my I have a couple windows. Oh, is that supposed to have a thing in it? I just looked at one of my windows and it's actually open and it doesn't have a shutter on it. Ah, okay. Well, all my other windows have shutters except that one. Hmm. Well, that's weird. Why wouldn't that one have a shutter? They don't have a shutter. I wonder if somebody's going to be in that window. Oh, spooky. It doesn't have glass either. Well, that's what mine don't. Mine don't keep. I need to look at the box. Yeah. Oh, no, the, the window's open. It should have a candle in it. Why don't I have a candle? Well, the, candle, the candle's over one notch. Oh, son of a gun. <laughs> I can't buy any more Lego because I have no room for it. Yeah. I have to build something in order to buy something. Ah. And then I may have to resell the thing I bought <laughs> or built because I have no room. Yeah. Well, that's where I'm getting, you know, I've got that tall casing. Well, it's just like four shelves and it's square yeah. um, where I have my botanicals. Yeah. I've, rearranged and I've got an open shelf for this balloon house because you have to do that. You know, where am I going to put it? Ooh, I'm and on the last bag. Ooh, and it's tall enough where I can set it there and it's still Lego and it'll just sit there with my botanicals. I'm going to lift off the lid. Well, I can't do that with the dormer there. I'm supposed to get in there and play. I guess I need to take off the dormer in order to get into the roof to move the candle into the window. <laughs> you got it all made out, don't you? Yeah, and I don't remember how this works. Okay, so it goes up. And over. Okay, all right. We got you. There's the candle. Moving right along. Moving right along. Oh, there's the candle. Yeah, the candle should be over one notch. But I can't reach the candle without dismantling the fireplace. Oh, my Lord. We've got a problem. For the love of everything that's holy, why do I not pay attention to what I'm doing? Is it Karen Randall? I hope she's laughing. It's Karen Randall. <laughs> I hope we're providing her some chuckles. <laughs> Why do oh. these people see I can't get to the candle? The table needs to be in front of the window. Okay, well, you know, I'm not going to be able to let this rest. So now I'm going to have to take off the... Oh, but I can't take that off. Maybe I can take this. Yes, I can take... Oh, shit, don't fall apart. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I hate when I hear that. Oh, no. Oh, no. And it's because. Okay. Well, all right. Hold on. Let's see if I can Ooh. get my fat finger in there to move the table over one notch. Have you got a strong. No, no. Have you got a strong tweezers? <laughs> oh, you got a long nose, needle nose. Okay. Yeah, but it's not long enough to. Pick up the That's table. Some, I, I've got a set of tweezers that are pretty decent to get, like when I was building those minis. Holy macanoli, you got to have tools to work on stuff like that. Yeah. Because it just doesn't want to work with our fingers. Jeez. And I don't have real big fingers, but I've got adult size fingers. Uh, Kim said, I'm definitely am laughing, but I'm also very nervous that it's going to fall apart. 
yeah. Okay, the candle is in the window. All right. Good show, girl. <laughs> now you got to put your top back on, hey? Yeah, I know, but that... Oh, dear Lord. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I got to move the... I have to move the... Yeah, that. The spider. Okay. And then this goes back. Oh, no. <laughs> He's back on. You're saying that, oh, no, an awful lot. <laughs> I get it. I get it. Okay, here. Can I push this up? Yes. Yes. Okay, now where are the tweezers? This is all very delicate. And if you if you yeah, move this I bar know. too much, it's going to fly off inside the house. That's exactly how I love if it my flies house. off inside the house, y'all, it's staying off. That's what happened with my little Walkman. Oh, it, it went together. And I picked it up and I must have squeezed the wrong part and it just blew up in my hand. I had to start all over again. Unbelievable. Okay, I think it fell apart inside the house because now it's not moving. But no one's going to know that, so we're just going to move on with life. Well, well. Whatever it takes, honey. It's just the weirdest thing. They have the weirdest one tiny pin holding the wheel together. Mm. Yep, and I just knocked over everything in the house. Oh, fudge. Yeah, it's not really player friendly. All of the green bubbles just flew out everywhere in the house. All the green bubbles. Oh, yes, no. I have green bubbles in my crock. You see? Oh! <laughs> it's the brew, the witch's brew. The witch's brew, of course. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God, yeah. The whole wheel came apart on the inside. Oh, no. Well... All I can say is you got I can't fix it without taking the whole house apart. Oh, jeez, Louise. Ugh. I know. I built my Walkman three times, and now it's sitting on the shelf, and and it's got a little piece of rubber underneath it, so it doesn't slide, it doesn't do nothing, and it just sits there and looks pretty. Hello, Bluey. Hi, Hello, can you hear me okay? Yes, we can hear you. I get close to the mic. Well, if I find my mic. I can hear you. Wait a minute. Where's that little part go? Wait a minute. Yeah, so the whole wheel came off of the thing. I'm just going to, you know what? This oh, it goes here. There's no way for me to fix this without taking the whole house apart. Well, maybe Charlie has an idea. Oh, I'm not going to put that to him. What oh. was it now? Just the weird, the weird way they built the fireplace. It's really cute that you can spin the water wheel outside and have the flames shoot up through the fireplace. Except they have it holding together with one pin. And so when that pin slips out, when you turn the wheel, then you have no way of getting back in there to fix it. But he might have a tool that could do it without building the whole house all over. You know Charlie sure. and his tools. Just let him think. He's oh, well, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a man of visual. I'm a visual man of I'm a I'm a man of visual clues, so I'm not, I'm curious on why is why is a water mill fueling a fire? <laughs> it's a uh, witch's brew house. I don't know. A great question, bluegrass. But yeah, so it's uh, a kitschy little thing where you turn this outside wheel, and then blue flames shoot up through the or pink flames shoot up through the thing. But they have it built very strangely with a really weird piece, and it doesn't stay connected. 
Hmm. And I know it's not me because I double checked it the second time I had to build it. Yeah. So this is on a Lego unit or something else? Lego. But see, look at how jacked up this is. This is how they have it. And then it fits together with a long, with a long um, rod that never stays put. And doesn't stay connected to the pin that's holding the water wheel. Are they like a Technic axle? Yes. It's a whole thing. Oh. Silly because I can't get the pin back in. Uh, you have to turn the wheel a little bit. They're, yeah. I think they're like rated at like, like 30 degrees. So sort of get it ready to nest and then turn the other the other bit yeah and the thing is that the two bits that the pin goes into spin it's not it's not stable so every time you go to lift the piece the little the piece that the pin goes in slips down uh did you get to the next step because sometimes they like you put like a tile or something on top of it that locks it up Ooh, and yeah, there is no lockup. There's just this. Well, then we have to. Then you make a little lockup or something that keeps that stabilizes that. It's like uh, a Technic brick that has the axle hole, so something to stabilize that small and a tile. Um, yeah. I've had that with the. Remember my hat from Brick World. You're, oh yeah. Yeah, so there was a lot of like, uh, you got to read the book on like, uh, when you build these mechanisms, that there's a, uh, sorry, finding the words would be like, it's a torque steer, so that you're basically creating a moment around an axis, so you're going to have lifting if it's not properly Stabilized. And, uh, no, oh. I, I get what you're saying. And then it slips off the floor. And then if you have to. Uh, it's, uh, I'd say just, um, I mean, is it is it like going to be something you're going to play with every day? Well, no, but now the flames fall down into the. Because I can't. I don't even know that this is lined up now. That's where, that's the other thing, is the lining up is, is also key. There's no way for me to tell if it's lined up because I can't see it. And I can't just pull the piece out because it fits into the stairwell. So, here, maybe I'll get it by luck. We've had the carousel. We've had that, the roller coaster. You have, like, they, they give you extra links. It's like, if you don't count every link, and we're talking 23 in the small links, and if that, if that, they call it an Eiler gear, if that Eiler gear is not properly tuned. Like this, look at how tiny this pin is. True. And that's supposed to go through a brick and hold on another piece on the inside of the house. Like I yeah, have no other, I have no other pin. That's the, the pin doesn't, the pin barely makes it through the brick. Well, I think, okay. So now that pin now. Sometimes my thing is bring that pin out, bring that pin out some, and then then you can nest it. Because I've had that with um, the uh, the winter the winter village had a at a small carousel, and you're talking. Can't even. Wait. Here, let me. Yeah, they're just. It's, it's okay. Yeah, uh, Hoosier's not even on. Hoosier's just something about an ice ice cream catastrophe. Uh -huh. But uh, it's okay. Well, I, as they I say, uh, not my, not my, uh, not my goat, not my farm. 
Oh, well, that's a long picture to have. I mean, I kind of thought that there was like an unwritten spoken thing that you don't stream over the top of someone else, but that doesn't really apply to people like me. So we're just going to keep calm and carry on. Well, it's like a Nashville. Well, it's, it's, it, it's the, they have the a Nashville built to brick, brick universe, oh, built to brick fair. Uh, I know. You know. Of course, you know, he, he was, he was a ghost. He was a cricket during Brick Universe. And then, I'm sorry. It's fine. I don't really care. I'm not doing it for that. I'm just doing it to hang out and build. Okay. I, I, I'm here with the best. Oh, my God. If I touch one more silly piece, it isn't supposed to move. I know. I know the feeling. Okay. Is this going to work now? Okay. So, I got the pin in. I can see it. I can need to press that down so it doesn't move again. Yep, because it keeps moving. Because it doesn't attach to the floor once it starts moving. Oh, Okay, now the whole thing broke. Like, I can build Lego. I can. But you can't give me something that makes no sense at all and expect it to work. Yep. I agree. I agree. And sometimes I question the order that they build it in. Like, why does the chandelier or the, the candelabra have to be on the table when I'm trying to build, like, a mechanism next to it? Yeah. So now the pin is out again, and here we go, and now we can't get it to line up again. Yay! Focus groups. Focus groups did it. Yeah, they need some women on the focus group panel because <laughs> we would not deal with this. This is silly. Um, no offense. Well, I no bet you there are. <laughs> oh, Charlie. Are you getting a cold? No. Okay. A lot of heavy breathing. <laughs> okay. and, my, and my nose is plugged. Okay. Well, that kind of sounds like a cold, Charlie. <laughs> yeah, I'm just saying. It well, it, it, it comes and goes. Oh, my gosh. This morning, I was like. Well, then it's, like, the, hum it's the humidity you guys are it, getting. Because that's what we got today. It is so. I, I put my air on this morning before I went for my walk so that when I got done with my walk, I was huffing and puffing and I could come into the air conditioning. <laughs> oh, we're, we're due for like- Because it's bad today. It's very bad here with the humidity. Charlie, where are you? Uh, I'm in the doghouse. <laughs> There's a weird noise upstairs. He's in the dog. Uh, well, there's 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 two dogs, three rabbits, two turtles, two placos, and Gary 3.0 and Gary 4.0. Shall I go investigate before I oh. let her know the dart? No, it's stopped now. Okay. 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 It's uh, okay. coming up on 3.30, so Don't anybody breathe. Don't Over. anyone breathe. The roof is going back on. You can Fido. do it. I think it was Fido pushing it. the phone around. You can do it, my dear. You can do it. I'm going to do it. Here it goes. Yeah. Yes, do it, do it, do it, sweetie. Okay, the roof is back on. All right, now leave it. And then I'm spreading the flames. Okay, and I'm turning the wheel, and the flames are going down. Okay, not touching, no more. Yeah, just okay, putting leave the it top back on. Okay. Putting the dormer back on. Oh, okay. It's it's done. Woo. Woo. Okay. Woo. Did we get, get get that on a mill's plate? We could do a little backyard with a little graveyard. Oh God, Good where did this job. go? Good oh job. crap! I forgot the green pot has to go back on the fire. Oh, oh drabs. Oh, sorry. Oh, swear jar. Sorry. <laughs> There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, everything is going to be fine. Here we go. We're putting the pot back on the on the fire. The 
pot is on the fire. Okay. Okay, that's good. And we'll put the candle next to the thingy. Okay, that's good. We're going to close the doors. That's never going back in again. <laughs> okay. Back to the fireplace. Bag 15. Last bag. Oh, now we only have 20 minutes. Now we have 20 minutes. Well, uh, all right. I'll set a timer. Okay. May not finish this this week. Then we'll finish it next week. I'm not going to finish it. That's for sure. One bag, you don't leave it on the counter. You got to finish it. Run, run oh, we stay on. Yeah. There, there you go, Chuck. I can do it. You can do it. Because if you can't commit to something, I commit to crap all the time. It's well, then you fall for anything. So I'm here to tell you. Finish the bag. Finish the bag. Finish the bag. Fine. Oh, that's a lot. Of, well, here, you need to take a break. Here, I tell you what. Before that bag, you need a, that's a lot of small pieces. You should take a break. I'm not take, take 10. Just take, take count to 10. No, Do your no. ASMR. Cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve days. Oh, well, no. Now we have to learn Japanese. Ichi. Oh. Ichi san shi. Charlie, did you build my chair? Uh, I am at the the back the backrest right now. It had torque requirements. It had what? Torque requirements. Torque. Okay. T O R. What What does that mean for you and I? That it will be uh, a chair that will be well assembled. All right. I'm hoping it 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 changes all my medical issues. Well, did you get a prescription for that chair? I did not. I'm just flying by the seat of my pants. Does it have um, extra accessories that we can get with? Uh... Well, it came with a pillow. Oh, it's got a pillow. It's got a footrest. It's got, man, that's a napping chair. Yeah, well, yeah. I'm not hoping to nap in it, but I am hoping to support my lady self. And well, sure, there her. there are some. Uh, I I did highlight the um, for uh, for the consumer warnings. Um, I'll let you review. Like, don't sit in it for more than seven hours a day. <laughs> no, actually, uh, funny story. There's a that that pad has a it's, it's a seasonal aspect. There's summer and then there's winter. Honestly, God, one's a cool bum and one's a warm bum. <laughs> but I'm dumb. Well, damn that! Oh, excuse my language. That sounds pretty nice, Grandma. I think you're fine. You dropped the f bomb on the last stream. <laughs> I know. I know. Uh, that Maybe Roll that footage because I just I just put one here a minute ago. <laughs> so there we're even. Swear fact, jar. Swear jar is right. And I didn't mean to do that. Well, what do they say here? What's going on here, little one? If the mood strikes you, I mean <laughs> Well, I didn't mean to do that. I really didn't. Wait a minute. Where does where does this guy go? Oh, for God's sake! I don't know where it goes. Oh, it goes over here. Okay, I got you. All right, but these little pinkies don't they don't fit because it hasn't got two things. 
paintings don't fit because they don't have two things. I'm yeah. sure Kim Randall knew exactly what that meant. All right, here, you see, look at right. You see, they got those little flat things. Yes. Well, what this middle one only has a little one round thing to attach it to. And it doesn't stay right. Where's my fingers here? Wait a minute. I These cameras, they get me ex all mixed up. Never mind. <laughs> I'll figure it out. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. It'll be fine. <sighs> All right, this one goes here. Right. <coughs> but I don't, it, something is not copacetic here. <laughs> Kim Randall said, woohoo, way to go, Buddy Bricks. <laughs> <laughs> I got my, my thing back together that should have never come apart in the first place. Yeah. Thank you for the encouragement, Kim. We could all use a little encouragement. Well, I need it now, too. You can do it, Grandma. Well, yeah, if I switch these little bricks around, then everything is copacetic, but that isn't how it's supposed to be. Well, maybe it is, and maybe the directions are just wrong. Well, that could very well be, too. Yep. So we're going to do that. And do it. Do something on the outside, well, so be it. Oh, here comes another window. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. The windows are, are have brown in them. So good. They have brown in them. Huh. huh. Go figure. What is that? Does it look like that on the box, too? I don't know. Where's the box? Yep, it does look like that. I'll be darned. Okay. Well, whatever. Oh, here. Yeah, the long ones are... I've got little ones for for the uh, oh, little yeah. square windows. Okay. Everything is okay. Yeah, All right. I'm going to be dramatic Onward. about windows. I know. Onward ever, backward never. Uh oh, wait. I would help you, Grandma Badger, but it's a bit far to drive in a wheelchair from the UK to America. Ha ha ha. <laughs> we understand, Kim. Oh, bless your heart. We're just happy you could join us for the chaos that is building. Oh, yes. How everybody can stay calm when they're building stuff is beyond me because sometimes tempers flare <laughs> in my house. Charlie and I know nothing about tempers, do we, Charlie? <laughs> uh, the only temper I know is steel. And you know tempered how you make tempered steel? steel? Yeah. You're tempered forging steel. a fire. <laughs> Two, four, six. Oh, and as long as, hey, now, Charlie, as long as I got you on there, I told Susie earlier, I do not need any tools. I went to Menard, and I got a very nice salesman, and he pointed me in the direction of exactly what I need, and it didn't cost me but $20, and it's fine, because I've got it in my kit now. If my, my wheels loosen up and wobble, I can tighten them up myself. And it was not what I was trying to find the prices. He said, no, you don't need that big handle and the expensive because you're not working under a hood on a car where you need the torque and all that stuff. So, Well, I'm glad you said that. Hold on. I just I set him aside here. Oh, now I bet you he found something. Ah, jeez. I have no idea. Oh, hold on. Oh. You can tell me everything. Hold on, hold on. Let me see. let me see where I'm at. Oh, the last. Oh, wrong, wrong angle here. Hold on. Um, and I'm not uh, here. Uh, put a pin in that for one second. I've got a I've got a battery dilemma. 
Oh, I always have a battery dilemma, dear. Uh, well, mine, well, this time it's easily remedied. Uh, Thank goodness. It sounds dramatic. Hello. Uh, here you are. Here we are. Uh, no, it's it's on my uh, streamer here. There we go. Contact. Yes. Little, little man's angry. Is he a barkin? Yeah. It's that time of the day. Yep. He didn't eat breakfast, so he's oh. you know, ravished. Ravished and needs his nibbles. Yeah. Oh, he's just. He'll be fine. Yeah, he was he was fine yesterday. Uh, wait, second now. All right, let me try this again. Oh, here we are. Oh my God, we've got times two. What are you trying to do, Charlie? Nobody. I'm trying to. I'm trying to show you what I had. Oh, I see. Oh, and now you're seeing the ceiling of his shed. Yeah. Well, I had to adjust my camera. You know how cameras are. Yes. They're little buggers. Well, back in the day. We didn't have live streams. We had to be like on point every day. So here's what I did have was, was these. They're called a dog bone wrench. Oh, yes. Okay. And so you can use these for every uh, up to, up to okay. one inch. Okay. And so you were talking about deep well. These don't matter. Because there's a pass through for each bolt. Yeah. See, so I needed the long. Kind of I needed the long socket because it goes down inside, and then just the ratchet. So that's what he showed me, and he showed me a cheaper version because I don't have to have so much strength to do that. And he said it's not necessary. So. For the money, I, I just took it and I thanked him and it worked perfectly because I loosened it up because it was a little bit too tight. My neighbor got it so tight that the wheels couldn't turn and it was getting hard. So I loosened up and it works beautiful now. Funny story is that in the instructions for her chair, uh, there it says if the if if the make sure that you didn't over tighten that for to make the feature operate. So yeah. yeah. Always don't ever don't ever tighten. Yeah, exactly. See, and and um Dennis was not using a ratchet, he was using a pliers and adjustable pliers that you can lock. And he, he just has too much strength compared to me. And that's why he over tightened it. He did loosen it a little bit, but I said, no, it's fine. And then I thought, I want to take care of this walker myself. So I'm just going to go get the tool. Luckily, he told me it was a 19 mm. So that's what I looked for. And everything worked out copacetic. Copacetic? Copacetic. I, I, that's, that's as close as kosher. I, I. <laughs> oh, yeah, more pins. Woohoo. Ooh, now, wait, what? Zap. <gasps> oh, jeez, Melissa. Woo! Don't use so much strength, Sue. <laughs> We're just toys, Grandma. Well, now, now, funny story is because that's what that's what uh, I was saying to uh, y'all a second ago about yeah. there were torque requirements. Is that you know some <laughs> things you need to be strong, strong, or you know get a wrench on. Right, right, right. Some things you don't. Yeah, but I thank you very much for trying to find it or whatever. But I did all right. 
and I keep the tool in my little tool bag and then I know where it is. It won't get lost and everything is fine. It doesn't matter because you're still getting one of these for Christmas. So <laughs> Welcome to two. Tool Talk with Grandma Badger and Bluegrass. <laughs> because they were on sale when I got them. They're, but now also... But now... Okay. <laughs> you want to talk tool time? <laughs> I mean, I gotta finish the bag, so why not? All right. So there's there's different kind of sockets. So this one, it has this style here. So yeah. there's this guy now. Now tell me the difference in, in these two. So, um, because you can tell. Wait, wait, wait. There you go. So, yeah. uh, mine so, is more like. Let me think. Let me think. I think I've got more like the, like your whole big ratchet, not the single one. I think, wait a minute, just a minute, I'll get the tool. Ah, don't worry about it. What I'm saying is that this one, this, this style is more versatile. This style is more versatile than this one because it, and like you say, you know, it's like Billy Mays would say, you know, this is not, this is what it's supposed to look like. But when you start rounding off things, you, you move things around, you start curling those creases, you can't get this on the thing. But now if you get this, which has a higher, higher point count. Yeah, that's what I've I got. I could go on. I could go there. on. See, there. Yeah. No, see? that's a good one. And see now, yeah. now, and that's got, it's got the rounded bits too, which uh, yeah. makes it also equally better. But see, I only needed this little thing because he said it was cheaper. And for my little, you know, for my hand and to do this, yeah. it, it's perfect. Well, let it, me see it. Is it got, is it like a gator thing? Is it, uh, show me that socket. Is it just for the one you got? Yeah. That's all you, I mean, if that's all you need, they, they'll that's sell you, right. you know, a, a $300 I tool for, kit. I was looking for sets. And it was a waste of money because this is the only time I'm going to need this socket. Is just I don't use sockets around here for any other reason. You now know? you have the one socket you need, and then yeah. you have the ratchet, and right. now you can buy any socket you ever need, and those are the last sockets you'll ever need. You can, right. and and I've got sockets I never use. Yeah, and exactly. what do they do? I bought Charlie a huge socket set when we were dating. It's mm -hmm. still here. But see, it's now that it. another thing, a lot of the sets did not, they went up to 18 mm, but not 19. And I needed a 19. Oh, so thought, gosh. Get me started because it, <laughs> we were, do, I was doing, um, I'm doing flare lines for brake fuel lines. And so you yeah. can buy one set that has like, all the odd numbers and then you have to buy the other set that has all the even numbers uh-huh and it's mm, printer ink triggered yep well that's why i thought you know forget the set sue you don't need it because you don't use it the only thing i need it is for my walker and to repair that or to loosen it or tighten it or whatever and maintain it. There is the word I'm looking for, maintaining it. That's all I need. So I spent the money and it's down the road and it's perfect. So Well, just wait, because the next walk you you the what next walk you need is gonna be a twenty one millimeter. <laughs> <laughs> but then guess what? You'll have the ratchet already. Yeah, right. <laughs> Well, it was Johnny Cash who wrote a song about it, One Piece at a Time. One Piece at a Time. I love that song. I love that oh. song. <laughs> I, I had to write, a, I had to write, um, I had to write an essay about that song <laughs> to get out of juvie. Funny story. Sorry. Long story. <laughs> Long story. <laughs> I don't think I want to know that you were in juvie, but it does. Well, that's that's that that's a, that's well. Now I've triggered about one piece at a time. Yeah. Yeah. When you work, I love I love that song though. I got fifty one seventy three. Yep. 
I do too. I, I can't even keep track of it. I'd have to learn it by verbatim. Yeah, but it is. <laughs> and I laugh every time I hear that because I've got it on my YouTube music. I saved it. And Speaking of Lego, it's one piece at a time. Yes, yes, absolutely. And that's what we call a segue. <laughs> Unless you're, you're Dave, that other guy who made a segue. So apparently butt shops, uh, hey, how could we, hey, well, hey, butt shop can pick you up, ma. <laughs> you're on the way. He's coming here Tuesday. Yeah, I know. He's going to make it to for Nashville, and that's terrific. That's just terrific. Well, we'll probably, I'm sure, of the, th the three or four of us, we'll we'll go live stream and have you on. Yeah, don't worry about it. And, and, and do you know what it's going to be though? When it it's next? No, uh, no, no. You, you know what it's going to be when that happens, though. I know you know. Slice of heaven. Oh, it'll be a slice of heaven. Yes, absolutely. All right. <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> Well, here, I'll let y'all wrap up. Yep, I just finished. Oh, that's wonderful. Um, and if I could take I the camera uh, off, I would show you all, but maybe next week when I figure out how to take the camera off. But here's the top yeah. of the house. Oh, wow. Uh, they need a roofer. We know a guy. <laughs> I, can't, I can't show you the rest of the house right now because I can't flip the camera. And if I tip the house, uh, I know. Don't uh, know what's gonna don't, happen. Don't do it. <laughs> but it is. Yeah. Coming. Oh, that's. I'll put pictures that. on the Insta. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I, I've got to rewatch uh, the the second episode to to get, and we'll 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 uh, like you say one piece at a time. We could do that. You know. Yeah. Well, I got words. So far, it's part of my house. That looks great, Grandma. Hold on. Yeah. Put it on big screen so you can see. Yeah. Yay. Yep. Whoa, is that the that's the world one, isn't it? No, this is the uh, this is the non Lego balloon oh. house, and this is the it's supposed to be the up house. Oh, yeah. well, hey, the up house. give it a name. I'm Nine. calling it the balloon house. Well, uh, the, 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 the closer we the, the farther we get from there, then then the more we build. Yep. <laughs> It's not a problem. All right, everyone. Well, we're going to go ahead and end this one. Thank you so much for everybody who did come out. Even if you only stayed for a few minutes, I'll get you guys in Nashville. I'll, I'm back to I'm back to your chair. It's, <laughs> been, a, it's right. been a slice of heaven, everyone. It has been. Bye, everyone. Bye. Have a great Bye. weekend. Bye. Bye. Bye.